Motherfuckers. <clears throat> Good fucking god. It's time for a malt liquor video. And you ask, Causer, what the fuck was that shit? That shit right there, motherfucker? That's the sound of the lowrider, oldies, drinking community at its fucking finest. Sing it, girl. What a fucking song. You guys miss most of it. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> Lowrider drinking community. Lowrider oldies drinking community. You just gotta fire up the old good shit. Anything you like. And just fucking chill back and just fucking get drunk. Alright, folks. We're approaching fucking day fuck 18 19 in the quarantine fuck good god day 15 at fucking work so far health still at 10 out of 10 i owe it all to malt liquor i ended up getting a revised poster i still got the old one right underneath folks it's still there we got the original as well this is the revision. <clears throat> Pardon me. Malt lettuce. We got ourselves a new fucking poster up. Showing how big and bad fucking malt liquor is. And how actually fucking ridiculous and stupid the COVID-19 is. Fuck. Good fucking God. What the fuck ever. Malt liquor kicks ass when it comes to fucking curing the coroni. Fuck, always has. They fucking cured the fuck out of some corona I had last night. And I'm just making sure that I get rid of any kind of traces that I may have picked up today. I went and got gas earlier, folks. No gas mitt. I used one of the paper towels out of the motherfucking windchill washing area. Fuck. Still gotta hit the keypad. Good God. And I don't have fucking sanitizer. That's where it's at. They put it in the sanitizer, folks. Shout out to Fear for going live earlier. Everybody tuned in. Anybody who's anybody was in that fucking live chat. Except for the few fucking strangers. But, eh. Fucking can't fucking... You can't block everybody from checking out what the fuck you're doing. People want to see. And they also have the itch to fucking chime in. Good God. Shout out to everybody that's still got to go to work. No fucking big deal here. What are you boohooing about? Yep. Talking to you. And you. And me. Yep. Talking to my fucking self as well. Good fucking good. I would much rather be at work than sitting around doing jack fucking shit. <clears throat> I'd also be happier being at work than sitting around waiting for my fucking phone to ring for some asshole to be like, hey. Uh, I got a job for you. Can you fucking f unfuck my fucking plumbing? Good God.
It is what it is, folks. <clears throat> Fuck you, shout out to Piss Glenn and his ugly fucking cats. Those cats look like straight up fucking street cats that continue to live on the fucking streets. And Piss Glenn, you're a cat owner, so I'm sure you've fucking heard it before, but a cat fight? Fuck. <clears throat> That's some real shit. Cat fights should be something that is like, you know, bum fights. Like, you want to see a cat fight. You want to see... It's almost like chicken fights. Like, yo, I got the baddest fucking cat, dude. I'm about to let him loose in the fucking ring. Throw him bets down. Uh, only one cat walks out of the two fucking cat fight. I lived in a rough neighborhood where my cats got in fights all the time. and It's because motherfuckers would come up into our yard. And I would go out there. Me and the cat are fucking fighting... The other cat, I wasn't getting involved, but I'd be throwing firecrackers or something, man. I'd just be like, yo, fuck that shit. Cat's scare easy anyhow, but I'd be like, yo, there's a fucking cat over here fucking making noise, man. We fucking, we're, we're getting it on. Fuck that motherfucker. Speaking of cats, hey, Shady, when's the last time you changed the fucking litter box over at your house, you fucking cat-owning piece of shit? Yeah, fuck it. I had cats when I grew up. I know what they're all about. Like I just said, cat fights. But fuck. <laughs> the litter box. <sighs> We're not going there. This is a malt liquor video. It brings me to my next point. This is fucking Friday Eve, folks. Drink them if you got them. Read Gabe. <clears throat> if somehow you're watching this, Go fuck yourself. And also, fuck you for trying to be like, you know what? I only drink maybe one day out of the work week, you know? Uh, fuck me. And I'm like, bro, if you only drink once, that's fine, dude. I get it. I understand. You know, I'm sure I, one day I'll be the same fucking way when I'm your fucking age and 120. But for now... If you're going to sit there and drink your entire weekend away, maybe if you kind of add a little bit of drinks. I know that you work nights. <clears throat> and it's kind of hard to fucking drink in the day. I get you, dude. I understand. But I'm just saying, you know. You get off work like you have before at fucking 3 a.m. And you get home and you fucking, you don't have to drink an entire 40. You buy some fucking tall cans, you fucking piece of shit. <clears throat> Don't fucking drink your entire weekend away like some kind of a fucking hard-working American who's like, these are my days off. I'm fucking, I'm getting fucked. Fucked and fucked up. Get yeah. Approaching the swill, folks. <clears throat> Saddest part of the fucking 40. Not the worst part. Not, not the worst part at all. The saddest. Because it's over. And Piss Glenn, I talked to you privately, publicly, about these fucking tamales in a can. Here they are. They're fucking all across the world, you know. Everyone can get these. These are not regional brand. Little tamales, there's a six pack of them. I've never had this big shit before, but I did read the back. I'm not going to fucking zoom in on the f too much, but it, these are wrapped in paper. <laughs> Little fucking corn meats wrapped in paper in fucking sauce in this can. Good God. Fuck. What has the world come to? <sighs> Either way, folks. Fuck. Can I get some fucking tune skis? Yep. Please don't be an ad. Oh, it's a fucking ad. Keeping our customers, employees, and communities Good God. During these uh, who cares, dude? It's not uncertain. We know what's going on. Shop at Sprint.com new phone deals like the Samsung Galaxy S25 G for just zero dollars a month. Skip. Shout out to James Montana. Twenty nine. And speaking of twenty nine, two hundred nine, Jay Jones, you fucking piece of shit. Well, liquor fuckers. I'm trying to make videos under 10 minutes from now on, but hey, you know what happens when you boo shit? The fucking clock goes on. We're past 10. We're at the swill. We're at the fucking adult swill. 
Low Rider Oldies Drinking Crew. I just decided to take a break during that swirl because fuck you, Shady Moss Shadows. Didn't you fucking take like five breaks doing your fucking old English swirl? <laughs> Don't drink that shit, dude. Quit buying it. I fucking hate that name shit. Speaking of old English, hold on, folks. Speaking of old English, folks, wasn't it supposed to be coming back in glass? If anyone stuck around to watch the whole video, wasn't Old English promised to be black back in glass? Back in black glass? By some high archy individual. Some guy who's way up here in the YouTube world was like, hey, guys, Merry Christmas. Old English is coming back. I, I fucking called him. I'm still waiting, dude. April Fools? Fuck, I don't fucking know. Either way, swill fuckers. Low Rider Oldies drinking crew forever. Remember when Mickey's was in plastic, but it came back in glass? Fuck yeah, dude. I remember that. That's the good shit. 